I'm only doing six and a half k's today, but five of them are gonna be high intensity interval training. Hold up. Interval training part has finished. Thank God. And now I just need to warm down by running a few more laps. I'm so sweaty. I don't run around the track just because it's so boring but it's really handy for high intensity interval training h-i-i-t high intensity interval training is basically as the name suggests training at a really high intensity in intervals running at the track makes that really easy so that i can just sprint for 100 and then jog for 100 sprint for 100 jog for 100 and i usually do that about eight times around the track with a few extra laps just for like warming up and warming down and stuff like that holy crap it's hot though my watch says it's only 29 degrees today, but I beg to differ. Hi! Yeah, not bad. <laughs> Enjoy your beer. Bye. Well, that was a mistake. I gave up on the toast, but it's okay because I've made what I think is probably the creamiest smoothie I've ever made. Look at that. Oh, this is ice cream. Why am I sweating in the kitchen? It's so damn hot in this country. I love makeup. Smoothie was really delicious, but actually the reason it gets so creamy is just because there's so much like air bubbles in it. So I feel very full of air right now. He's getting a pedicure. Is this your first one? It is. Ooh, how exciting. Ooh. It's so cheap. Yeah, so cheap. Mm. So with the show I'm doing at Universal, there's only certain colors that we're allowed to get on our nails. It has to be either orange, pink, orange or pink, or some kind of shade of that. Is that correct? Maybe like a light pastel -y. Mm. Anything that's like pink, but not like bright, bright pink. No sparkles, no color colorfulness, unfortunately. Mm. How's your feet going, Robbie? Good. Hold on, I need to film this shaving. It's intense. So much skin coming off. It's like a cheese grater on his feet. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> How's it going? Wow. I'm not watching this vlog, Hannah. <laughs> How do you feel, Robbie? You feel dandy? <laughs> all right, now that my nails are all pretty, <clears throat> I'm gonna go and do some aerial hoop practice. I practice at a place called Gym Craft. They have open aerial training, three hours between three and six. And it's $35, which is kind of expensive, but it is Singapore. Hello. Here it is. Gymcraft is a gymnastics center and they've got, obviously got gymnastics, equipment, gymnastics floor, they've got some aerial equipment and then next door there's a climbing gym and they've got some parkour stuff here too I think. It's pretty good, it's just, uh, it's really hot and there's no air conditioning so we're prepared to be sweaty. Singapore!
the best part about training at Gymcraft is that they've got all of their own aerial equipment here. So they've got silks and trapeze and hoop, rope, and all the other rigging equipment that you need for it. And they've also got chalk and um, rosin and everything as well. So it's kind of nice if you just want a place to train and you don't want to have to bring your own stuff along. So I guess it is worth $35 because you can still train for up to three hours and you can use all of their equipment. Uh, but it does get expensive if they come in every day. <laughs> get like a good close-up of this sweat what is this some drop of sweat like in my brow I know I talk a lot about Singapore being really hot and sweaty but like I just can't handle it I'm so stripping off my chin <laughs> oh, I just feel gross all the time <laughs> So just now when I was practicing something, one of my moves, I like twisted a little bit too much to the right. And I really like, really overextended something in my waist, I think. No! I feel like I got one more in me. I also feel like I should do this, but. No pain, no gain. like the shortest session I've had in a really long time. I've only been training for like an hour and I have to stop because I'm scared that the injury is gonna get worse. I don't know what I've done. I think I've just pulled it or twisted a little bit too hard, but now it kind of hurts when I breathe. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> and thanks, have a good day. I don't know if you can really see this in the video, but the sky is beautiful right now. Ooh, that is a nice cloud right there. I just got home and I'm desperately running out of daylight right now, so I'm gonna film this quickly. I bought some Tiger Balm plasters and I'm gonna just like stick them all over my hip waist area where I've hurt the muscle. Uh, if you wanna see the routines that I came up with, uh, check them out on my Instagram, I'll link it there. If there's something different, something more, something less that you'd like to see of my videos, let me know in the comments down below. Let me know if you're doing any aerial training or what brought you to my channel. I'd love to hear about that. If you like what you see, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more, subscribe. And I will see you next time. Bye.